Lele and hello everyone welcome back to my Sangi channel again so today I'm gonna show you a Tibetan soup noodle which is one of my favorite so I hope you guys will enjoy watching my video and watching this noodle how I'm making so let's start So I bought this one from TNT uh, so the water is boiling now so once the water boils you can put a little bit of oil so why I'm putting the oil because the, if you put the oil it will not stick the noodle will not stick so okay so the water is already boiling so I'm gonna put the noodle Noodle, you can put it like this, like that, and you have to stir it nice. Meantime, I'm going to do the preparation for the salad. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to chop this onion in the dice, small pieces. Okay, so this part I'm going to do it. Okay, guys. So you know this onion, you have to make it dice, small pieces. You have to make it small pieces. The noodle not stick on the pan. So you know the pan with some cold water. So I see the noodle has not stick with each other. See how nicely the noodle I see it's not stick. See? Okay. So the noodle part is done. So make the beef stock very tasty and flavorful so you can put the beef and this is the cow feet and some beef bone okay. putting a shijuan pepper some salt some turmeric Putting a soya sauce. Okay, so beef stock. So let it boil, and I will boil it for like two, three hours. Okay, so now, it's okay, so now I'm going to chop the tomato in the small pieces. Once it's done, I'm gonna show you guys how how we can eat. So the prep is done. Okay guys, so it's been almost one hour and look at the stock of the soup. So you know normally the taste flavor of the soup came from boiling the water so you have to boil it as much as you can so that you can get a very flavorful soup okay guys so when you are cutting the beef when you take out from the frozen so you can defrost it but you can keep a little bit uh, frozen so then I will show you see once if it's a little bit frozen then when you are cutting it's very nice and then see it's so easy 
and you can make it small pieces as per your needs so see it's so easy to cut so when you are defrosting you can defrost it little bit and you can keep it little bit icy cold so you can make it dice as per your needs and it's so easy guys so you can just do like that see it's so easy right as you can see here while i'm cutting this beef steak okay so now what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna fry the beef so let me put the oil And look at the yummy soup still boiling. So look the soup of the beef. So you have to make it dry this one. Okay, now this is almost coming out quickly now, guys. Okay, my family come for a dinner and they are watching my Sange channel. My family is my big supporter as always. I'm so blessed to have them all in my life. Okay, so I'm gonna show you how you can make a soup noodles. So you have to put the noodle like this. Like beautiful. Okay, and then you can put the beef sprinkle. And then now you have to put some chili as for your needs and some chopped onion and some chopped tomatoes. I have to look colorful guys. See? Now I'm gonna pour the soup on the top of the noodles. Final top with the coriander. Okay. Gotta go, gotta get working, get up, gotta get working all day. Get up, gotta go, gotta get working, get up, gotta get working all day. Clara and June, digging in the dirt, Clara and...